Hello guys. Um, this video I just wanna share with you and show you and help you how to if you are uh, searching how to apply um, approval, how to apply approval permission to marry <laughs> permission to marry a Singaporean or permanent residence uh, because uh, if you if you are working permit pass holder and you wish to marry Singaporean or permanent residence here in Singapore before before uh, before you get married before you get married uh in or out in singapore you have to um you have to apply for approval no permission to marry your partner your girlfriend or your boyfriend before you do that before you marry you have to uh, apply for approval to mom before you married before you apply uh, no, before you married okay so i will show you um the website okay so guys if you wish to marry a singaporean or uh, permanent residence here in singapore must remember you ask a permission uh, you get approval okay you get approval before you marry your uh, Singaporean or permanent residence uh, fiance here in Singapore so that uh, you don't have any you are you are not getting trouble later on okay so let's do it I will show you the website okay so guys this is the Google and you type how to apply permission to marry to marry Singapore MOM so as what you can see in this screen <laughs> sorry I have a small screen so um, so this is what you can see all right so you open this um, uh, this one if you are as a working permit holder how do I apply for approval, approval to marry a Singaporean or permanent? Okay. You can see. So, this is what you need to do. And you read it. If you are currently a uh, current, uh, current or former work permit holder who wishes, wishes, to marry a Singapore citizen, you must uh, apply approval from MOM. Uh, okay, guys. So just now you, I show, I show you the the website, and here you will you will read that if you are current or former work permit holder who wishes. To marry a Singapore citizen or PR, you must apply for approval from MOM. So, okay, if you are uh, working here, so you need to um, apply for approval. Okay, so let, uh, so I will show you again. So, okay, if you are EP or S pass. Okay, you once held EP or S pass as the last work. You are in Singapore citizen. This one you don't need. You don't need to apply for approval if you are EP or S pass holder. Okay, note if you don't seek approval when required. To do so, your privilege to work in Singapore could be withdrawn. You must be prevented from entering Singapore for a, a period time. Okay, so this is what how to apply 
okay how to apply so this is the requirements you need to prepare these documents a uh, singaporean or pr so they have to to submit these documents uh ic nric six months pay slip from their current or most recent employer latest income tax and assessment from iras and past three months cpf statement certificate of highest qualification attend any legal documents okay if any applicable and then this is for working permit holder so declaration form later i will open for you the declaration form i just let you read this one first uh, for applicable uh, application to marry singaporean citizen pr okay so passport uh you have to send your passport and your working permit card and your six months pay slip for from your em employer certificate of highest qualification attend any legal documents certified change name if you have ever entered in singapore okay so this is the additional documents Additional documents if you are annulled, a uh, divorce or widow, something like that. So you have to this one married certificate, divorce certificate, okay, late spouse death certificate, doctor memo if you are pregnant, if you are if you have both children, okay, you have to pass the certificate as well okay so um if you send the email to the mom we will email outcome singapore citizen of pr within four weeks so once you email them you will wait for for two actually two to two four weeks so okay so let's uh back and i will open the the declaration form for you to see okay so download okay all right so this is the declaration you have to print out this this uh pdf so declaration form for application to marry so you have to to print out this form okay and you tick Okay, this one is uh, both myself and in then you just read it this one and this is for you applicant and then this is your uh, this is for the the intended spouse. This is for the uh, Singaporean citizen and for the PR. Okay, so this one and then this is for you. All right, this is for working permit holder so you just take you just answer it okay and then here okay so you put your name and sign put his or her name and sign and then the date okay so okay that's it and then um we back again i show you how to send it okay so after after the declaration form uh, you already um sign okay and you click this one up, apply for approval okay all right so this one mom apply for permission to marry singapore citizen or permanent residence okay so go down the estimated is uh, 10 minutes to complete you have to you have to um put this one uh, this one to answer it okay applicant this is for you to answer it your full name okay your full name your working permit number 
your passport number, gender, date of birthday, marital status, okay? If you are single, if you are single, married, divorce, uh, okay, your highest uh, qualification. And are you staying in Singapore, yes or no? And then this is for your spouse, spouse, okay? So, uh name and cr date of birth gender okay so okay so what you need to upload okay so um okay you just tick this one you just tick whatever your documents need to to send to send to them okay so you just tick just like something like that okay this is just example only okay so okay you just answer it tick 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 and then you upload all the documents here the just now the declaration declaration the declar declaration and then all your documents you just uh uh you just uh, click this and upload the the old documents and put a sif something like that and uh contact and then email your email your phone number and declaration you just tick tick and submit okay and then after you submit and then the the mom website will So guys, um, so just wait, after you send, you just wait the, the reply from MOM and uh, if, if they need some of documents, they will email you. Okay, so that's it guys. I hope this video will help you and please do sub subscribe and also if you want to ask something, uh as long as i know the answer i will help you okay so that's it thank you for watching